Hello and welcome to another video from the best of cat series. In this question, we are going to touch upon a concept that involves logarithms. I would suggest that you pause the video, try this question out on your own and then have a look at the solution that will follow. If you like our content and want to experience the IMS pedagogy, you can join the IMS zero fee prep programs that will give you access to concept videos, sectionals, full length tests and more for free. You may click on the i button or on the link in the description box below to access the same. Happy learning! The question that we have here is rather easy to look at. There is not a lot of storytelling. It simply tells you that log of 81 to the base 12 is p. Then what is the value of 3 times 4 minus p divided by 4 plus p? It is a very straightforward question. The options are also nice and distinct if you look at them. So we will go about solving the question in the usual manner. Just that we can pay attention to one small bit and can shorten our problem solving process. So let us understand what is this log 81 to the base 12. Now the first thing that we can do here is we can write this number as log of 81 to the base 12 or log of 3 raised to 4 to the base 12. So I will write this as log of 3 raised to 4 to the base 12. Now if you are aware of the concept of logs, you can say that this is going to be nothing but 4 times log 3 to the base 12. That is the representation of this number. Now what we can do here is, we can simply substitute the value of p in the expression that we have to find the value of. So this is nothing but p as has been given in the question. So we have to find the value of 3 times 4 minus p, which means 3 times 4 minus 4 log 3 to the base 12 divided by 4 plus p, which means 4 plus 4 log 3 to the base 12. Now, if I simplify this further, what I can do upfront is I can cancel out the 4s from the numerator and the denominator. So, if I take a 4 common from the numerator and I take a 4 common from the denominator, I will be able to cancel those two 4s out. What remains here is going to be 3 times 1 minus log 3 to the base 12 divided by 1 plus log 3 to the base 12. Now, if you know that log 3 to the base 12 is nothing but log 3 divided by log 12 to the same base, we can write this expression in the form of 3 times log 12, say to the base 10, it does not matter, we can say it is to the base 10, minus log 3 as it is. And the denominator will simply become log 12 plus log 3. And this is because we have cancelled out the log 12 from the denominators of both the numerator and the denominator. So that is why we get this particular term. Now we also know that log a minus log b is going to be log of a divided by b. This is the basic rule of logs. And we also know that log of a plus log of b is going to be log of a times b. So here we are going to see that 3 times log of 12 divided by 3 is going to be log 4. And in the denominator, you will have log of 12 plus log of 3, which is going to be log of 12 times 3, that is 36. So log 4 by log 36 times 3. So what we can do is, we can simplify this as log of 2 square times 3, or we can say it is going to be 3 times log of 2 square divided by log of 6 square. So what we are going to get here is 3 into 2 log 2 divided by 2 log 6, that 2 will get cancelled out and we will be left with 3 times log 2 by log 6. If you want to write it in a simplified format, it is going to be 3 times log 2 to the base 6. So if you look at the options that we have here, what are we going to get? 3 times log 2 to the base 6, but it is not there in the options. So what we will do is, we will take this 3 as a power and so we are going to get log of 2 cubed to the base 6 or log 8 to the base 6. So the correct answer here is going to be option 3, that is log 8 to the base 6. Now if you have understood the concept and want to test it, we have a replica question at the end of this video. Do try it out and let us know your answers in the comment section below. Happy learning!